problem as long as you consistently get it right. That's all I care about, right? I just want you to get an A. Okay, so I would have u to the fifth. This is divided by 3, du <coughs> over 3. Is everyone with me? I know I'm kind of being tricksy. Yeah. Because I really didn't feel like writing cosine 3 and, yeah, I was kind of lazy. Who's with me? Yep. Who's lost? Who wants me to write out solving for dx? <coughs> okay, this became u, but it was still to the fifth. This is du, but I had to divide by 3 because I didn't have that 3. So that's where that 3 is from. So this is the same thing as a one-third integral of u to the fifth. I'm going to add those to the power. Divide by the new power, <coughs> plus c. Um, what's 3 times 6? 18. You you know. And we're done. Except for this looks funny, so I'm going to write it bigger. Okay? Ooh. I think sines and cosines are not too bad. I think secants and tangents are brutal. Are you ready for them? Yes. Okay. I'm gonna do one more sine and cosine and then we'll do secants and tangents for probably the rest of the time. Yeah, what's up? Uh, which formula? Yep. Got Z on the test. Um, Okay, guys. Sines and cosines again. Which one's my u? Why is it sine? The denominator, yeah. So, I've got u equals sine of 2x. The derivative of that is cosine. We leave the inside alone. Multiply by uh, the remaining inside. I don't have that 2, so I'm going to divide by that 2. So now I have the integral of du over u, and then a one half in front. Okay, I skipped a bunch of steps. Who did I lose because I missed my step? Okay. Um, only a few people. Is it okay if I go on? I don't want to be like mean, but is that okay? Do you have a quick question? Exactly what I'm getting to. Excellent. So this now becomes one half. What's the integral of du over u? Ln of u, which then is one half ln sine. Now the reason I'm having you guys do this is they'll put this kind of thing on your test, but if you realize that this is the same thing as cotangent. The integral of cotangent, ln, sine, but you would have had to do a quick u sub to get this one half out in front. Do you see how you could do it two ways? It's okay? Sweet. This <coughs> is money. And the reason I'm saying that is because this is something that 112 students start, uh, struggle with, but if you can do it, you're going to be conquering the hardest problems on the trick. Well, second hardest problem. you got to get to the ridiculous um, tangent and secret. <coughs> Colleen, thank you so much for erasing all these words. <laughs> I didn't mean to say it like for I was really thankful that you erased the board. And then I remembered that she couldn't erase this one because you guys were like, don't erase. Sorry, I didn't mean to be so shy. Helen's 
There are two types of secant and tangent problems you need to be able to do. And we are doing great on time, <laughs> FYI. So, whew, we're doing okay. I'll, uh, if we get this done, I want to do these types of problems. And if we get this done, I want to do part with sines and cosines, because I like to do those. Okay. If I have...